Okay, before we jump in, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Also check off the bell notifications, that way you'll never miss any of the updates that we do weekly. Also, my contact information is in the description. Okay, today, um, one of the most common questions I get is like, what is probate and why do I have to do it? So what we're gonna do is uh, cover that topic real quick. And the, the definition, I'm gonna read it uh, uh, from the courts is what is probate? And it says it's the legal process through which deceased person's assets, debts, and property are administered and distributed according to the will or the laws of intestacy. If there is no valid will, it is a court-supervised procedure that ensures the orderly transfer of assets and resolves any outstanding claims or disputes. So uh, basically what uh, you're doing there is opening up a case with the court to have them administer uh, the process of devising the estate. Now, during the probate, court validates the deceased person's will appoints an executor or personal representative and that's probably where your interest is to oversee the estate administration and verify the estate's assets and debts to be of the deceased the executor role is to gather the deceased person's assets pay any outstanding debts taxes and distribute the remaining assets to the beneficiary heirs specified in the will or determining by intestacy laws so um that's the legal end of it, but there is a lot to be done from the accounting and the distribution of the assets. Uh, the accounting of all that has to be done, and uh, that's where Legacy Transitions kicks in on the more non-legal side of it. Your lawyer will take care of the legal side of it, but much of this process is going to be done by you or people that will help you get through that, and that's where we kick in. Now, it goes on to say the probate process involves several steps which may depend, vary depending on the jurisdiction. Filing the will and initiating the probate process with the appropriate court, and your attorney will do that. We have many attorneys that we can re recommend to you for that. Notify the beneficiaries, heirs, and creditors about the probate proceedings. Take an inventory of the deceased person's assets, and this is where the accounting comes in, which we have a program for that including the property, bank accounts, investments, and personal belongings. Evaluating and appraising the assets to determine the value, and that's another area that our team can help with, is evaluating the value of all the assets, not just the real estate, but also the personal property, and particularly with the state sales and stuff like that. And then also paying off debts, taxes, and expenses of the estate using the estate's attorneys. Great to always talk about this issue. Um, if you have any questions, be sure to reach out to me. Again, thanks for tuning in and until next time.